This video is going to detail the importance of creativity within education. There are several questions that will be answered throughout this TED-Ed. They include description of creativity, what research states about left versus right brain approach, the components, the elements, the importance of creativity, ways teachers can implement creativity, some of the advantages of implementing creativity, and why teachers should implement creativity in their classroom. Let's start today's video with what is creativity. The words creativity and create comes from the Latin creatus and creor, which means to make or produce, literally to grow. Creativity, according to Dictionary of Developmental and Educational Psychology, is our capacity to produce new ideas, insights, inventions, or artistic objects, which are accepted as being of social, spiritual, aesthetic, scientific, or technological value. According to John Kay, creativity is the entire process by which ideas are generated, developed, and transformed into value. It comprises what people commonly mean by innovation and entrepreneurship. According to Sir Ken Robinson, creativity is the process of developing ideas that are original and of value. Creative intelligence is dynamic, diverse, and distinct. According to Howard Gardner, creativity is about liberating human energy. And according to Johnson and Lamb and Sonamo, creating, creativity is creating new and original ideas and deciding the best ones to use. Creativity has always been an important part of, of education. It really picked up steam when research was done comparing the left versus the right part of the, of the brain. If we as teachers are implementing creativity within the classroom, we are having students use the right side or hemisphere of their brain. The right part of the brain focuses on several aspects including visuals. The right part of the brain processes information in an intuitive and simultaneous way, looking first at the whole picture, then the details. The focus of the left brain is verbal, processing information in an analytical and sequential way, looking first at the pieces, then putting them together to get the whole. If we as teachers are combining the left and the right brain and implementing creativity, we are having our students use their whole brain throughout the entire lesson. There are three main components of creativity. Expertise, creative thinking skills, and motivation. The three of them together combine to make creativity. You may not have one such as, you may not have two of the three and not have one to have creativity. You may not have expertise and creative thinking skills and not have motivation to have creativity. You must have all three to be able to have some form of creativity. There are three main elements which influence creativity. The first main element is modeling. We as teachers must share our thinking with our students and explain how to create or combine ideas. We must also communicate expectations. We must let our students know that creative ideas are expected and welcome. And we must reinforce creativity. We must apply to creative thinking even when an idea does not succeed. The importance of creativity within education. Creativity is important and it is the key to work and prosperity within the 21st century. It's also the requirement of any industry that you go into. Despite what job you have, creativity will play a role in that job in some way or another. Additionally, creativity allows students to adjust to the changing technology. There's also a few ways that teachers can implement creativity. We can provide regular opportunities for hands-on experimentation, problem-solving, discussion, and collaborative work. We may use of create creative thinking techniques such as brainstorming and thinking hats. We must also encourage our students to improvise, experiment, and think outside the box. And we must facilitate open discussions of the problems pupils, students are facing and how they can solve them. Additionally, we need to ask open-ended questions such as what if and how much you do something. We must encourage our students to share ideas with their classmates and to talk about their progress. And we must use failure or setbacks as opportunities to learn and to relate to creativity. There's three main advantages of implementing creativity. It helps our students deal with our ever-changing world. It also helps our students see further into what they are doing. And it helps our students build self-esteem that is necessary for success within education. The next piece of this TED-Ed is going to be a brief video detailing why we as teachers need to implement creativity within our classroom. It gives, it gives several stats and figures to help us understand the importance of creativity.
Remember when you were young? How the world was filled with art, music, and creativity. Instead of iPads, smartphones, and HDTVs. You didn't know it then, but along with experiencing all the joy, fun, and freedom, you were developing important life skills. Like divergent thinking. Problem solving. And innovation. Creativity scores have significantly decreased since 1990, especially with children in kindergarten through sixth grade. Because of an emphasis on core curriculum and accountabilities, Music and the arts have been pushed into the corners, if offered at all. This is especially troubling when you consider that CEOs in a global study picked creativity over all other leadership qualities. Employees feel similarly as creativity is regarded as one of the top three personality traits most important to career success. We all have creative potential, says Mark Runko, PhD, Director of the University of Georgia's Torrance Center for Creativity and Talent Development. Our job as parents and teachers is to help kids fulfill it. Isn't it time for a change? The final thing I'm going to share with you is a folder that I have created that you have access to that has subject area creativity strategies for you to implement within your classroom if you so choose. I hope you enjoyed viewing this TED-Ed related to creativity.